This is an overview of a laser harp project I'm working on for the Jewish Children's Museum in Brooklyn, New York. Now the harp you see in front of you that's done, this is a harp of a similar pattern which I completed about six months ago. And this one actually has eight green lasers. It's myrtle wood and it's carved in a sort of a somewhat of the fashion of the, f of the harp is going to be for the Jewish Children's Museum. Now the drawing here shows much more detailed what I'm doing for the uh, JCM there in uh, Brooklyn and it's going to have Hebrew carving, it's going to have detailing to make it look as if the harp was carved out of the trunk and a branch of an olive tree including olive leaves and branches and actual olives and this one will have seven green lasers and it's going to be set up with a water vapor fog that will be there in the room on the third floor, I believe, of the museum. So you'll see the green lasers very strongly with that vapor. And this is a template uh, copy of the drawing, the color drawing, right here. This is black and white. But I'm using the template here to trace out the pieces to assemble the harp. Now the core of the harp is in these two pieces of myrtle wood. There's going to be three one inch layers put together. There's actually, that'll be the core, the three inches core, the center of it made out of these pieces. And they're going to have the chambers for the lasers cut out and the wiring that will supply the power and also the sensors uh, uh, lines leading to the bottom of the harp and out from there. So that'll be the core and uh, it doesn't look that impressive at this point. The color of the wood's not that obvious until it's sanded and finished out like this. And then I will use more highly figured pieces of myrtle for the outer areas, so where the carving and the detail. There'll also be applique leaves that'll be firmly made part of the structure. And uh, yeah, it's going to be quite, uh, quite interesting how it turns out. Similar to this, but not exactly.